In today's video, I'll show how to upgrade memory in a desktop computer. I have Dell Optiplex desktop mini tower computer, and I will be upgrading its memory today. Is it even possible to upgrade this computer? Because every computer has a maximum limit of memory it takes. Searching for Dell Optiplex 780, and this link comes up, which is um, uh, from manufacturer website. So I'm going to go to this. And here's the, the guidebook, the technical guidebook, I think they will tell us. Here is the section on memory. And for the mini tower that I have uh, for this model, it says it has four slots, four DIMM slots, uh, four memory slots, and uh, each up to two gigabyte, and total maximum capacity is eight gigs. To find out how much memory is installed and how much uh, we can add to the computer, two ways, either go to system information, which is right here, go in the start button and type in system information and that will give the answer here. Or you know, restart the computer and when it's powering up, go into the settings and that will show. So let's try that one. Not boot sequence, but F5. Powering up, I press the F2 key, that was the settings key, and I am now in the settings section. And here I'm going to click on system board, and here is the memory section I'm looking for, which is has 4 gigabytes installed. This is the type of memory that's in here, it's 1066 megahertz, DDR3. Um, so there are 2 GB here in one of the slots, 2 GB in the other, and there are 2 empty slots, so which means I can add 2 and 2, another 4 gigabytes. I'm going to open the computer and just to confirm that I do have 2 empty slots before I order the memory. So I'm going to make a note of the type of memory I need and let's open the computer. Also from here, I'm going to press, um, here I'm going to press exit and I'll restart the computer and then I'll shut it down. This is probably one of the easiest computer to open because all I have to do is pull on this tab here and the front cover would open. All right. You can see with one hand, you can see the cover opening up and just by pulling on that the uh, tab here. So with one hand, I can just remove the cover. One of the easiest computer, no screws to open. Here's the inside of the computer. And what we're looking at are these two memory slots here, which is this one here, and the other one, which is right here. And we also see here there are two empty slots, the two black empty slots here, one of them here, and the other one on the other side. So uh, we just confirmed so that two slots are taken, two are empty, so we're going to order the memory and install it. When I searched for memory on Amazon, I found this Samsung brand memory, which fits the specifications that I am looking for, which are DDR3, PC3, 10600. So um, I am interested in this memory, and I'm going to check the compatibility here. Uh, this is Dell, Optiplex. Um, here is the computer that I have. Oh, this is perfect. It says it matches, it fits my computer. So I'm going to order two of these. These are new banks of memory, $13 each. I'm going to order two of these. All right, here is the memory we received. Now, this is the Samsung memory I received, and here is the number on it. A two gigabyte is 10600U, and I'm going to go and install it. So see the partition is on this side. Um, so we're gonna go and install the first memory here. So it goes right in that channel here. The other one, and just push that in. I should hear a click sound. And the other one. Awesome. Okay. So the next memory is here. So I'm gonna get the the stick of memory here. I'm making sure there's a partition on this. 
is on the front end. So it goes right here in that channel. And push that right in. Click and click. Awesome. The way we open the computer, we're going to close it the same way. So it goes like this. Pop right here. And close. Awesome. So let's power it up. And let's see what happens. So all right, so let's go into the system configuration again and confirm how much memory we have now. This is eight gigabytes memory installed, 222 all the way. Awesome. Thanks for watching.